guys, what's up? It's Miss Atlanta, and yeah, I'm in the kitchen. I look a little bit of a mess. My eyes are a little bit off because I actually am supposed to have a migraine right now, but I had a migraine. Um, it's still there, but it says ease point, but I can still feel the pressure like seriously on my temple, so I'm like taking it easy, but I never allow or try to allow that to stop um, what I have to do. So yeah, it is, it's 8-11, um, you guys, it's 8-11. I got off of work at three today. Um, I'm just really getting up and moving around. Um, yeah, so I decided, I wasn't going to, but I decided to go ahead and record. I prepped this morning, but I have a few um, dishes that need to be washed. I've had this Dollar Tree stuff over here forever. I actually, sorry, put a lot of it away already, um, but I need to just get this stuff put up because clearly I'm not gonna do a haul. I haven't been to Dollar Tree in a minute, um, yeah. So I'm making a quick, just some sloppy joe. So I have some ground turkey over on the stove. Um, yeah, so this is like my life in the evening. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I'm gonna go ahead and run this water right now. I already put the um, dish soap in here and I also have some bleach that I put in the water. All right, now I just have like a silverware or whatever in there and I'm gonna wash these few dishes. It looks like a lot more than it actually really is. Um, but yeah, so let me do that real quick because I know this water running is pretty loud. If you guys are going to use any of my cleaning videos as motivation, let this be the one because I feel like crap, you guys, like my head is starting to hurt more. The payments are starting to wear off. My back is hurting just too much. Anyhow, if you're going to use cleaning motivation, use this one because no matter how you feel as a parent as a mother you got to get up you got to push you got to keep going i got the bags all yeah. wet but let's throw this little dollar tree stuff in here what is in here i had got this charcoal infused um toothbrush y'all because i had got the, tar the charcoal infused um the toothpaste and i want to try it with the toothbrush so i got that um, i always get my coffee from the Dollar Tree and I get this um, roasted ground coffee premium quality French vanilla and then I can't do hot chocolate I realize that hot chocolate makes me have migraines every time I drink it for whatever reason so I use the French vanilla and I mix the two together this is a French vanilla cappuccino um, yeah and then I picked up these towels and these pot holders because I got my little fall decor going around the kitchen. 
but I was like, I'm not sure about these because they look a little grandma-ish um, to me. So, you guys, <laughs> comment down below. Keep it real. If y'all think this is too grandma-ish, I'm not sure if I want to take it back or keep it at this point. Um, but I got them. I picked up some ketchup, and I'm actually going to use that because I don't use um, sandwich mix for making um, a sloppy joes, which I have to turn off because I'm overcooking the meat up there. And I have picked up these, if you guys saw it on Instagram, it's the Softy um, Perfect Edge Control. So I got two of those, so the mini and I can try that out and let you guys know how it works. A lot of people was asking about, does it work on 4C hair? Well, my hair is not 4C, so I can't answer that for you guys. And I mentioned that on Instagram. I think I'm flicking water everywhere. I picked up some more of these waters. I'm taking these to work. I realized that I don't like sparkling water at all. I did pick up the lime flavor and the grapefruit. I have them in the refrigerator. I tried the lime. It's still in there. It tastes like bleh. And this is the grapefruit. I don't really want to open and waste it, but I don't think I'm gonna like this one either. So let's try it anyway. That I just poured it here. This I'm so. And why would I try this now when I've been nauseous all day? <laughs> oh. Yeah, no, but the grapefruit is the first one that I actually. It's the best one, but I still don't like it. So yeah, I got six and six because they were $12, $4. So I had got six of the lime and six of the grapefruit. I'm taking those to work along with the, um, what were the ones I got last time? Blech. These ones are the most disgusting. That's the black raspberry. I basically done like overcooked this um, turkey, so this is definitely not no cooking tutorial. I seasoned it with seasoning salt, pepper, and garlic salt. And I typically would use like brown sugar, a little white sugar. I'm out of brown sugar. Brown sugar, some white sugar, some ketchup, and like barbecue sauce. And that's how I mix up and make the sloppy joe. So, yeah, I'm just gonna mix this up real quick. So we have something to eat real quick. Um, got some chips from Albertsons. They're $1.77 when you buy three um, bags. So just sloppy joe and chips. If you don't nobody want to eat, don't eat. Yesterday I fried some chicken legs for the first time ever. I hate dark meat um, unless it's wings. But I fried some chicken legs and um, got some rice or whatever. So eat some leftovers if you don't want this barbecue sauce open but yeah eat some leftovers if you don't want to eat this eat it for lunch or whatever i don't care at this point it's one of the moments but i just wanted to hop on here you guys check in check in with you guys do a few shout outs so yes i'm gonna do a couple shout outs and then i'm gonna go ahead and end this video thank you guys for watching um yeah i hope you guys enjoy if no other video has given you motivation please allow this to be the one um this is one of the reasons why i don't participate in like October and Blogmas and stuff like that is because I never know how I'm gonna feel you guys uh, right now I'm not sure if this if my headache is from my migraines or my allergies or a combination so yes okay, I'm, I'm done blabbering for this time but shout out first of all speaking of Blogtober shout out to my girl Diva Diva Passionista you guys she has decided to participate in Vlogtober um yeah, so go ahead and check her out. I, yeah, I did a community post on Blocktober. I have mixed feelings about it. Um, she talked about it a little bit in her uh, Blocktober day one vlog. So go check her out, you guys. And um, yeah, so shout out to a few of my male subscribers um, who had some birthdays. Some um, Jaren Lumpkin. So today is October 
second, I believe. So I know y'all done seen them in y'all comments and everybody comments and everything. So Jared, I hope you turned up. A shout out to Jared Lumpkins. Um, also, either like yesterday, day before yesterday, shout out to Chef Disaster. Happy birthday to uh, both of you. And also, happy belated birthday to the Rob and they show. Um, happy belated birthday to Rob. His birthday was the same day as my brother's. I don't have a lot of males that watch my channel. Um, aside from Bay, who is like my biggest secret subscriber. Um, <laughs> but yeah, you guys. So shout out to all you guys. Thank you so much for all of your support. Everyone who has continued to support my channel. Um, yeah, and I will see you guys. I'll talk to you in my next video you guys i need to finish this up i need some more drugs because the struggle is very real so yeah i will see you guys next time bye